Oh, hi. So I've got these yummy chicken wings here, but I have to hide them from John because I found out he's obsessed with chicken wings. And I mean, he's seriously got a problem. Check out this video that I found. It's all about the wings. So we went to Irwin, Pennsylvania to find out some secrets. Not far from Pittsburgh, the Colonial Grill boasts the best wings in the world. And we tried three of the flavors they offer. The barbecue is at the bottom here, the Italian garlic to the upper right, and the buffalo to the upper left, which I took a bite out of for my own personal taste test. Oh my God. That's good. Mm. And it's not real hot and spicy either. It's got a nice kick to it, but not brutal. Mm. Mm. But it's a secret. Now we notice the seasoning for the wings are mixed in after the wings are cooked. We then found out what a secret recipe this is. So we went to the back of the kitchen to interrogate Nathan Illich, a cook, a caterer, and a martial arts degree in food? Okay, I have a black belt in cooking chicken, so nice. here I go. First of all, I bread it up. I like to leave it in the breading for about at least 10 minutes to get a nice coating on it. Bring it over here, let it sit. The breading is just some flour, some spices, we've got some pepper. So we have a lot going on in here. Okay. So far, no complaints. Then after I have it sitting in the breading, I bring it over here to the fryers cook about 25 pieces in each fryer. We usually have two or three going at a time. And after I have it in the, in the fryer, I leave it sitting there for about a minute. Give it a little stir just so it doesn't stick together. Make a lid. This is all pressure cooking. It's not just frying, it's pressure frying. And what is pressure frying? Pressure frying, instead of just sitting there in a regular fire, it takes longer. The pressure frying cuts down the frying time, keeps everything moist and juicy, and less frying time. It takes about 13 minutes. But our black belt cook is coy. He says you can't make this, but then he gives us some pointers. Listen. Well, the key would be most people don't have a pressure fryer unless they have a small one, but the key would be sit, letting it sit in the breading for at least 10 minutes. That's what I found out. That's my little secret. Yeah, we let the chicken marinate at least overnight in a special marination with like different seasonings and a little bit of sweetness to it. So that helps to keep the chicken moist and gives it the flavor. But everything else is a secret. And it is a secret we just could not crack. Nathan wouldn't give up the exact recipe and he says, without a pressure fryer, you won't ever get this taste unless you come to Irwin. It's worth the ride to Western PA because you won't get this anywhere else. Ah, chicken wings, man, this looks good. You know I love chicken wings. Mmm. Mmm. Where'd you get these? Um, I made them. Oh. Good recipe. You're gonna have to give it to me. Mmm.